Hey, it's me, Sam B, and welcome to Rwanda Vision. Ugh, can we turn these letters around? Sorry, this is my first time doing VR. So, like I was saying, Rwanda Vision is my virtual reality tour of Akagera National Park. Let me wander inside your mind and show you all the park has to offer. We're talking bubbles, fresh air, bubbles. Ooh. And if you come over here, well, actually, don't look there. That part is still under construction. But believe me, there is so much to see here. Lions, giraffes, hippos, elephants, rhinos. And yes, that is a real animal, not just what Donald Trump calls Susan Collins. Let's go! Shh, don't scare the animals. Because we didn't want to interfere with the animals, and we also didn't want to get trampled, sometimes you'll be seeing things from my point of view up here in this giant car slash magic school bus. Anyway, I love it. No, <gasps> let's go. <gasps> Akagera National Park is a protected area in Eastern Rwanda. It includes wetland habitats where crocodiles, buffalo, and antelope live, as well as mountains, which are the home to lions, leopards, and I don't know, all kinds of monkeys. And savannas, which turns out are grassy regions and not a Democrat's best hope in Georgia. See that little lady? She's a Maasai giraffe, and no, she's not just staring at you, she's digesting her food in peace. And those little buddies are zebras. Oh, can't see? Siri, we're talking about zebras. Fine, fine, I'll just do it myself. Fun fact, a group of zebras is called a dazzle, and no single zebra shares its stripe patterns with another. Aw, what a beautiful snowflake. I mean that in the best way possible. Isn't VR amazing? <gasps> zebras! Buffalo! Take in the sounds of nature, the sunlight coming through the tall grass, our little friends, the olive baboons, which, like college freshmen, travel in groups of 15 to 150. How many do we see here? Shall we count together? One, two, ooh, three, four, five, six. Oh, okay, we don't have to count together. Fine, we can move on. If you listen very closely, you can hear the sound of the vicious and honestly pretty annoying hovering creature. The wild drone. Also, here are some impala. Impala are everywhere in the park. They're like our common American squirrel. Entitled, messy, and fearless little shitheads. The horned ones compensating for something are male, and the darker antelope and back are called topi. These bachelors are fighting over a lady topi. As you can see, toxic masculinity runs rampant in the topi population. Here he is! The rhino! Oh, I didn't know rhinos could do that. Yes, this is totally a real animal. Ooh. These trees are home to some of the rarest animals in the park. See them? Look at that log on your left. It's a blue monkey. Okay, I know they're black, but they're called blue monkeys. No, this is not a is the dress blue or gold situation. Ooh, do you hear that? The blue monkeys are telling each other to chill because we're not scary predators. There it is again. Let's let him know he doesn't need to be afraid of us. Communicating with a monkey. Okay, one... Two, three, Ow! Well, that was rude. And no animal in the park is as exciting, thrilling, and not forgetful as this one. No, not that dead thing. This one, my favorite animal in the park, the elephant. Welcome to the splash zone. These modest creatures can weigh up to 14,000 pounds, and contrary to what Ted Cruz may say, are not Republicans. Oh, maybe we can get closer. That's nice. Oh, too close, too close. You're in my personal space. Wow. 
Agagara National Park is the home to way more animals than I've shown you. Python alert! Oh! Oh, here are some more zebras. Look at them all being so striped. The park is constantly growing, and if you're in Rwanda, I highly encourage you to come through. Well, thank you for joining me on this virtual tour of Akagera National Park. I'll show myself out of your head now. Oh my God, did you have to put the door all the way over there? Okay, whatever. Here. Hmm. Yeah, there isn't a, hope there isn't a lion under this tree. <laughs>